What's up, everybody? Cable Guy Ken coming to you alive again and well, I will add. Uh, if you follow my Facebook, you'll know that I am walking in the remnants of what's left of my trailer from a tornado. Now, we were in the process of moving, so, you know, it's not that big of a deal. It's uh, just going through and finding the stuff that we hadn't moved out yet that's, you know, salvageable. Things that, you know, might mean something to us. Probably wouldn't mean nothing to anybody else. But that's what we're doing. And uh, taking it all to the other house and, you know, making the most of it. That's all you can do. God had a plan. And he always follows through with his plans regardless of what you might be thinking. So the next video you see of me hopefully will be of me in my new place sitting on top of a battered up boat that my son came out here and rescued for me yesterday he uh got it for me and i told him i said well son it's beat the heck and back he said yeah but dad this is an important boat you need this for your videos so i love them to death and i i tell you it meant more to me than anything you could ever imagine just like this little bird feeder that I can't find the top of, but I'll put a top on it. He made this for me when he was five, eight years old, somewhere around in there. And uh, that was one of the other things I came out here specifically looking for. The sentimental things that, like I said, might be stupid to you, but to me it's all the world, you know. But this is it, y'all. This is the park. And that's my trailer. Well, what's left of my trailer. <laughs> so, and it's sitting on top of another trailer there. That used to be part of the kitchen where the refrigerator sit. No, I'm sorry, that's a bathroom. That's the uh, bathroom. This would have been the boys' room, I guess, then. Would have made the kitchen down here. Now, actually, you know what? It's flipped totally around. It looks like it's flipped 180 degrees around. I don't know. It's hard to really tell. I'm looking at where I see the, the heat exchange coming up out the floor, but that not even that might not even be right. I might be looking at the whole bottom side of the trailer for all I know, but it looks like the top side. It's black plastic on the other side, so that's got to be the bottom. But it's in pieces, though, because it's not right. That should be, yeah, that was the doorway entrance and the bathroom. This would have been the boys' room, the living room, the kitchen. Yeah, that's right. There's the kitchen. There's the heat exchange. Then our bedroom-bathroom combo, which the bathroom part is actually missing. It's laying on the floor over there. It looks like it hit the tree and clipped it and tore it off. But that's it, y'all. It's surreal. But, you know, like I said, ain't nothing to get upset about. I mean, obviously Mr. George is going to be upset because this was his place. He's lost, you know, a lot more than I have by means. So all prayers go out to him. The young lady in this house, a good friend of mine, had two kids trapped, but they're okay. There was a little cave built around them when all the debris came down in the house. God handled it once again. Uh, nobody got hurt really bad, just some minor injuries. And uh, this young lady down here went to the hospital in that trailer that's catacorner. It didn't used to be catacorner. And the trailer in front of me here was slid forward three feet on the foundation and everything. The blocks and all moved. So, you know, just you got to be in amazement at God's ability to handle every situation and still do what he needed to do. You can argue with me and say that it was an accident and what have you, but it wasn't. I mean, God had a plan. He had a design, and for whatever reason he did this, he did it. Maybe it was to renew my faith. Maybe it was to steal in faith in someone else. I don't know. But I'll say this. My faith ain't stammered not a bit because everything that I had lost that I really thought I needed to find, and again, they're all just material things, but everything I lost that I needed to find... I found everything was laid out where it needed to be 
and even every issue of self-reliance illustrated i have is perfectly fine so and they were sitting in a chair right in the middle of all that so cable guy ken y'all i'll check back with y'all a little bit later